In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can convert DVDs to MP4 format. Now, I am not responsible if you convert copyrighted DVDs to MP4. This is only for educational purposes only. Now, you wanna head over to VLC Media Player right here. Head over to VLC Media Player. And then what you want to do, once VLC opens up, you want to head over to the media tab right here. Then scroll down to where you see convert slash save. Click on that. And then you're greeted with all these options. You have file, disk, network, and capture device. The one you want to click on is click on disk. Then you have all these disk selections right here. You have DVD, Blu-ray, audio CD, and you have SVCD slash VCD. Depending on the format or the DVD that you are using, you want to choose whatever format of DVD you are using. For me, it automatically selected the DVD. So I'm going to leave it at DVD. Now, if you do not want the title menus like the play or select or scene selection, click on no disk menus right here. Then, if you do not see your disk right here, what you want to do is you want to click on browse right here. Click on browse and then you can browse for the DVD that you want to convert to. Now, you do not need to worry about titles or chapters because you're not going to be needing them since you do not have the title menus on your video when you convert it. Because you you clicked on the no disk menu so that's why it's not going to be converting and that's why you do not need to worry about titles and chapters. Now, the, the, now the one you want to worry about is if you want audio in your video, what you want to do is you want click to on, click on it from minus 1 to 0. And then you have this show more options button. Do not click on that because that will bring you to this option. You see? It brings you to more options but you do not need that. Uncheck that and you no longer need to have that. Now click on convert slash start. Click on the drop down menu and then you will see that you have a bunch of options right here. The only one you want to click on is convert. Click on convert. And then you see the source. That's the DVD that you're going to get converted to. Now, come now the settings you have is you have settings convert. You do not need to worry about these outputs right here and this button right here. Do not worry about these two right here. Now you have the profile, which is the video format that you want to choose. You can choose any video format that you have. You see, there's a bunch of formats that you can choose them to convert your video to. I'm gonna leave it at default video right here. I'm gonna leave it at default. The default is H.264 plus MP3 plus MP4 video. I'm going to leave it at default. Now, do not click on the dump raw input because that will take forever to export your video to mp4. Now, you have the destination. Destination file, you can click browse to where you want to save it to. And, make sure when you click on the browse to add a name to the file you want to convert to or else you're not going to be able to save your file if you do not save it and add a name to the file. You see, I want to convert it and it won't let me start. That's why you need to add a name and select the file you want to send it, save it to. I'm going to save it to desktop. Now I'm going to be titling it video test 2.0. That's the video that I'm going to be saving it to. And then click save and then click start. Now, you no longer need to have VLC Media Player open up once your video is done converting. I'm going to be showing you the video that we converted to MP4, which is right here. Video Test 2.0 MP4. Click on it and then your video should be playing. Now, you saw that the video got converted and it will play without the DVD inserted into the computer. So that's it for this video guys on how you can convert DVDs to MP4. So please like, comment, and subscribe for more how-to videos on how to convert DVDs to MP4.